Hi everyone, it's Miss Erica, and I'm going to show you an activity you could do to work on your balance. So first we're going to put um, some pillows out on the floor. You guys could use throw pillows, couch cushions, and you're going to make um, kind of like a bridge. So it's a little bit of an unsteady area. And then you guys could put an activity. So we're going to show you what a puzzle looks like first. Okay, go ahead. So you're going to froggy bend. Pick up a puzzle piece, walk across, froggy bend, and put the puzzle piece down, and then go back. So that's one of the activities we're going to do. And you guys can, you go ahead, show them one more time. Go ahead, honey. Okay. All right. And we're going to show you something else in a minute. Okay, so if you don't have a puzzle, we could also do building blocks. So she's going to show you, you could take some blocks and you guys could build a little tower or, you know, a little house or something. Go ahead. You can do one more time. So you can do it with blocks. And we're going to show you one more thing if you don't have blocks. And if you don't have any blocks, you could use plastic cups or Tupperware. And we're going to try to build like a little pyramid. And then what's fun is that the kids could kick it or punch it down when they're done. Another way to make it a little harder, if your um, child thinks this is too easy, we could change it up instead of regular walking. We could do heel to toe walking. Go ahead, honey. Heel to toe. Now you might want to stand next to them if they look a little unsteady, just so they could, you know, so you could catch them if they kind of lose their balance. Good job. Another thing we could do is called sidestepping. Good job. Okay, perfect. And if this is too much for your child, the pillows, um, the unsteady surface, you could just take it away and have them walk on a straight line. You could use painter's tape or you could use a piece of ribbon even. Um, if you're outside, you could also draw with chalk on the sidewalk. Okay, and that's our balance exercise. Thank you, Emma. Okay, um, there's actually one more activity that you guys could also do if those were too easy. It's called high knee marching. So the um, child picks up their knees and they march across the pillows and it helps them to hold that single leg stance. Good job.